uh, today the, the topic is race and politics. And uh, you know, Rudy Giuliani has had some interesting comments uh, along these lines recently, and I, I thought I'd start with you, Leonard. Do, yes, sir. Do you think President Obama loves America in the same way that you or I do? <laughs> I, I think President Obama loves America in the same way that you or I do, but I don't think he loves it in the same way that, let's say, uh, Newt Gingrich or, um, or Mr. Giuliani or uh, Sean Hannity do, which is to say, uh, uncritically, uh, and I think that he understands, uh, you know, uh, 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 what's his name, I'm blanking, Senator Al Franklin, Fra Franken had a great line that, uh, mm -hmm. you know, to, you don't, you, there's a sense among some on the right that you have to love America like you love your mommy, <laughs> which is to say, without any criticism, no blemish, she's, she is perfect, and if, you, and if you deviate from that, that that is, that that is not love. I think the president loves America like, like grown-ups love grown-ups. Okay. Um, and that is something that many, you know, on the political right, you know, fail to get. And obviously, you know, the, the elephant in the room uh, with uh, the reason that Mr. Giuliani questions the president's love of America is because, uh, the, uh, you know, the, the president happens to represent something that uh, Mr. Giuliani finds uh, strange and, and, and um, you know, a little unsettling. I will say this, uh, I don't want to get long-winded on this, but I will say this just as an African-American. I find it fascinating whenever African-American people are called upon to verify their love of country because we are the people who love the country when the country didn't love us back. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, when, you know, when, when my ancestors can tell stories like that of a soldier uh, in the Second World War, passing through a small Louisiana town, uh, who wrote uh, about uh, what it was like having to go into the back door of, uh, of this restaurant to, to, to eat while the German prisoners of war who were on the same train went through the front door and ate in the dining room. And yet he still is expected to and still does shed blood for America. Don't you dare question African American love of country. You know. I don't think they realize or maybe care how profoundly offensive that is.